All right, welcome guys. This is our promo video for a day on the trail season two. We are out here at the spot. It is currently 10 p.m. here on um, Wednesday, September 18th. Um, we are in the process of planning our first hike over at uh, Gold Strike Hot Springs over at Lake Mead. Lake Mead just recently reopened their hiking trails. They had them closed during the summertime. And we are going to be heading back out there in early October. But I just want to take a moment to look at all this that we have going on right here. This is a completely different vibe at night. We are risking our lives filming this here because... So, I just want to interject real quick. Um, the video just shut off. What? It's still recording, but the, the, oh, the screen went that. black. It does that. While the, you know, while the screen was on, like, our flashlights weren't illuminating as much as it was, and it's also much darker on recording, but yeah, we can definitely see moderately. Also, I'm concerned about something. What's that? There's a fucking arrow here. That arrow, I think that arrow's always been there. Yeah, there's an arrow here, and there's an arrow further down the ramp, if I'm seeing things correctly. But... If you want to continue, I will let you do that. Okay. So, over here, this here is a completely different vibe at night. Um, it's very scary. We're risking our lives doing this because we are risking coyotes. The possibility for there to be mountain lions. Um, you told me there wouldn't be any. What's that? You told me the only thing we had to worry about out here is people. Well, it's not completely eliminated out of the question. I heard something. You lied to me. Well, there's an arrow here, there's an arrow there, there's probably a couple of arrows. Do these look like fire pits to you? What is that? Uh, I don't think this is anything of note. Comment down below what you may think this is. Because it does not look like a fire pit. It looks like I somebody put this was, in there. Uh... This is a fire pit. Which is pretty cool. That's the shooting pole. We shoot the... Oh, fuck. Not something you want to see while hiking. A red smiley face. But let's go over here. Let's, I can't see a fucking thing. We are Handy. going to several new places that we haven't been to. Some I've been wanting to go back to. Some I've been wanting to go to, but we couldn't in season one. But we are going out of state to some of these. We are planning a hike over in Zion in Utah. There's, I think that there's still some places in in Arizona that we can go check out. Um, but, this is it. This is the spot at night. I cannot get over how creepy. How creepy this is. I have so much of a bad feeling right now. It's not even funny. Um, so, What's the verdict? Shall we continue forth and venture deeper into the unknown territories, or Yo, not? I don't. I see like flurries in my eyesight because of me staring at that light, but I think I saw something run across. I don't know. It could be the flurries. I was looking over myself and I did not see anything, so I'm pretty sure it's just you. Okay. You know, I've been thinking, maybe I should, like, start recording myself, just to hear my voice and to train it to be, like, a bit lighter, because whenever I hear this, my voice sounds a lot lighter in my head, and then I'm like, then I, like, listen to it back, and I'm like, ugh, my voice is bad. 
Oh wait, I didn't get a proper response. Um, so, continue forth or? What do you What do you want to do? I want to continue forth until you like you know get the uh, that bad feeling you always get and like we decide to back out. So, yeah, let's just continue forth. Do you want me to film the journey up there? Yeah, I got plenty of batteries. Yeah, it said like <laughs> it said like 300 hours you know, or 300 minutes. Cool. How do you turn the screen back on? Yeah, that's what I was thinking, like... Oh, oh never mind. My ear just had like a... Oh, this thing's, uh, this thing's rattling. And I rattled it over, he uh, over here to my right. And I'm like, what was that? But no, it was nothing. Remember when we saw a tortoise here? Yeah. That was awesome. I miss that tortoise. <sighs> I just realized something. You asked me to walk behind you. No, when I was filming, when we were filming, I just wanted you just to pay attention behind me. But I mean, it'll be a good camera to have you from behind me. So guys, let me know down in the comments, should we return here for uh, for an uh, overnight, like, hike or climb or whatever? Let me know down in the comments. You good? Yeah. Sweet. So on a scale of 1 to 10, how paranoid are you right now? Guys, should we also, so, we also have some new guests coming to the channel. Some of them are girls, get ready. One of them has already been shown. Uh, the, uh, Jesus Christ, that plant scared the fuck out of it. It's always the tall plants with the branches that scare you. I thought it was in the face. Like, every single time you, eh, you see that. It's always like, oh, that's a face. Oh, no, no. Um, but we, uh, the one member has already been shown to you guys at the tunnel exploration video. That was Jacob. We have a new, another member coming named Callie. And she'll be shown. Uh, we're planning a hike on Sunday. I don't know yet if I can come with her and her boyfriend, but um, if it does, I'll be showing it for sure. All right, please shine the light here. Feeling? Yeah. You know what I'm worried about? I've been seeing a lot of videos where, like, a Redditor or someone on 4chan or something, they, like see a video of somebody showing like a vague representation of a location and they're like, well, I searched for like 80 hours to find this location and I found it. And you know, then everybody and their mother is gonna show up here and ruin it. All right, Steven. I'm going to ask again. Do you want to continue, or do you want to go back? You know what, I think we go back, because that was even worse. Yeah, because up there, 
That's where we found like a campfire and a mattress. A mattress? Yeah, we found like yeah, we found like remnants of a burnt mattress. Oh yeah, because for some reason people like to burn mattresses out here downstairs. Well, yeah, they're big and flammable, somewhat easy to carry. So, if we go down this way, we might have to go all the way around this, or we can climb up. Yeah, no, I don't want to have to do either, especially go around it where we can't see around the corner. So, go back? Go back. Alright. We go back. What we do is go back. I'm going to my way. We can keep going hard. No wonder. Huh. So, um, also, so I kind of figured out our routine. So spring and summertime is going to be more of your randonautica, ghost hunting, um, exploration videos of sorts. And then fall and winter comes, we're going to be doing more of, uh, sorry for something. Fall and winter comes, we're going to be doing more camping, hiking, ghost town, stuff like that. Um, but we'll still try to mix in some ghost hunting in between the hiking and camping stuff. What the fuck? What? Oh, are you talking about that? Other than ours? Hello? Oh, there's people out here. They're just walking back. We're good. That actually scared the living shit out of me. Of course it did. You're a baby. <laughs> but yet we don't know what their intentions are. They're far enough away. Although if you want to pick up the pace, I wouldn't blame you. They're quite a bit bigger than us. Oh. Yes, uh, almost at the reservoir. Oh, wait, wait. You know, before you wanted to hopefully find some people here, have some good vibes and all that, but now that there are people here. Their voices are so fucking deep, though. It sounded like females. It sounded like some men. Like, you know, real men. The kind that go out and chop wood and stuff. Okay. Once you come over this hill, shut off your light. Keep the GoPro light on, though. Having a bit of fun? I mean, I'm 22 years old. Shut up your Oh, I 
Alright, we're going dark right now, boys. So, uh, you can't see me, I'm, the camera's facing towards me. But essentially, the recap of what's happening right now is there's people out here, there's like two guys. Um, as soon as we were asking questions whether or not we should move for, move on forward or just come back, as soon as we made the, the decision to come back, Jared stopped talking. I, we started hearing voices. I see two lights, I don't know, maybe like a phone light or something like that. And so then we're, we're picking up the pace back to the car. And somehow they're getting closer and closer towards us each time. Um, so I don't know what, really why they're out here. Usually um, there's a little cove in the back where a lot of teens, including me, go out to party and stuff like that. It's kind of like a secret area. But for the most part, besides Jared, Jared's the only adult I know that comes with me because he comes with me to these things. But this is mainly like a teen secret hideout area. And I don't know what, why two adults are out here at like 10, 30, 11 at night. So this is, this is hella weird. This is gonna be the promo video, but I think it's more than just a promo now. Um, this just took a very interesting twist. Coming up on like the houses area now. Yeah, that's also weird too. So the only lights that I saw were possibly from their phone, but other than that, they are not using any sort of flashlight or anything, which is actually astounding. Thank you for bringing that up. I say we stick in the car, keep the, just the keys out the ready, but do not run the ignition. We stay in the car and see if they come this way. We can get like an, a description of them. That would be creepy, but that would be interesting as well. Yeah, the first, uh, the first official hike of season two of our <laughs> day on the trail, we see a couple of fucking demons. I mean, to be fair, where the fuck did they go? I don't know. But they were uh, at like the bottom of the, uh, they were at the bottom of the climb at the reservoir. Last time I heard them. Watch it be my homie Logan, he lives in this neighborhood. Alright, I just sit here and let's try to wait. See if they come. This is just turned into some randonautica shit real fast. Now you guys probably won't be able to see it on camera. You have your keys in your hand just in case? Okay. Residents here, 
So instead of coming from this gate, they're going to come from, like, the actual, like, uh, the little code gate over there. Like, maybe they have a key or something. And if we are sitting here for, like, ten minutes and nobody shows up, I don't know where the fuck they could have gone. Yeah, it went to the tunnel. Possibly. But that even shows how much more weird it is. Either way, not our business. Yeah, who knows what they were fucking doing out here. Yeah, like, when I saw them, they didn't have lights, they were just joking around, they, they were laughing and stuff, and they sounded like two grown adults. They had deeper voices than Jared. Yeah, which I find very creepy. If one comes from that way and one comes from this way, we are out of here. Bro, if one starts beelining for us, like if I only see one and not the other, I am moving to Canada. Also, you brought up the possibility of instead of like a couple, uh, a couple of homeless people or crazies out here, you also brought up the possibility of skinnies. So, we might have just seen a couple of skinwalkers. And... Should I open the door and see if I hear any voices? I don't think I like that. What was that? Oh, it was a spring. If I see anything else, I will hit play again on the camera. Oh, that would have been heavy. Mm -hmm. That would have been heavy. If they wandered behind, they would have lit up all these lights. Okay, guys. So that just took a very evil twist. But if you guys, if, if this video, what is a good light goal for us to return? Like. In general? Or at night, I'm, at night. I'm going to say a thousand likes because that means a thousand people have uh, have not only enjoyed this but are also encouraging us to come back and that's how much encouragement I need to, uh, to come back. Okay. Once this video reaches 1,000 likes, we will return here at night and do a full-scale hike of the entire place. 1,000 likes. That's actually asking a lot, judging by how many likes each one of my videos get. But I will be paying attention to this. But, welcome to season two, guys. That was, this is technically our very, very, very first video of season two. So guys, keep an eye out for our next hike. It could either be one with Callie at Red Rock, or one with me, Jared, or me, Jared, and Callie at Gold Strike Hot Springs. But everybody, Please like, subscribe, click that bell. I got some humongous things planned for season two and you do not want to miss them. Everybody, take care. Peace.